Hi everybody, you're watching the Stupid Genius 55 here. I'm doing this is I'm your host of Champion Testing the Elite Four for Pokemon Platinum. What is this? I've as well as I can could I tried to replicate Cynthia's team. Now I wasn't able to do it exactly because I don't know what specific effort values her team has. So I just use like halfway effort values, basically half of, half of the maximum, I mean. And I gave them all max IVs because I know her she does have max IVs in our Pokemon. And I also have four full restores because she... So that's, I think, it's the amount that she has in battle. Because I, I think that each trainer can have up to four items, and I imagine she has four full restores, so... It, she doesn't... There's no evidence to think that she might be limited in the amount of items she can use in, your, in the fight she has with you. So, I'm just going with that. With what she has. And I'm just going to see if Cynthia really could have done it now. The challenge, I guess, for me here is just seeing, you know, how long I can last. Because, like, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm going to be worn down a bit, you know, without being able since I, if I can't use a whole lot of full restores here, so. That's all I have to, you know. <laughs> what was I going to say there? I don't know. I'm also going to find my rival Barry, uh, my rival Barry, I mean, ah, that sounded kind of... You know, it sounded kind of not good. That's all I can say. I also try and go with the Spear Tomb each time because, you know, I believe that's what she... <laughs> what she... Because she starts that off with you and I, I don't get to choose who I start off with, so... Um... <laughs> what else? Yeah, I'm not going to be healing up at the heal desk after Barry because, you know, the, he, I'm treating him like the first Elite Four member, basically. What? I, I, how did he live? How did that... How did that float so live? I don't think it did that best. Oh, and also, each Pokemon will be at one level lower than Cynthia's Pokemon actually are, because... You know, I might gain a level or two. If I do gain more than one level for each Pokemon, though... I mean, come on, I'm fighting... Like, when I get to Cynthia, for instance, you know... Come on, I'm fighting, you know, each battle. Like, I'm gonna be worn down, you realize, so... I think I'm, I might be a bit justified in this. Maybe I shouldn't have... Whoa, close combat. That's not going to bode well for me. Um, I guess I'll just use another shockwave. I could, probably shouldn't have. I probably should have sh saved my... Because, I don't know. Would I have needed any... Uh, what was I going to say there? I don't know. But I will be going with... No. Or a sphere. Let's see how well this does. Oh, Earthquake. Oh, oh, oh! Earthquake? Okay. Thank goodness. Well, I'm not gonna use Extreme Speed because I don't need to, in this case. So much faster than it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to use four of my full restores now. Um, okay, I'm a bit... Oh, also, I chose... I decided to give Barry, like, an Infernape before a starter. Or a Chimchar, not in a full-fledged Infernape at the time. But yeah, that's what is... What, 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 what was on the screen? What? Oh no, did I... I, di I didn't mean to not... Ugh. I accidentally... I mean, I, okay, I was still able to. I didn't see which one he had out, so... Anyway, sorry if I'm speeding up, like, the... You know, the music's gonna be a bit... You know, faster for you. But then again, this music here, in my opinion, is actually pretty... Not fitting, considering that Pokemon League, it just plays the Pokemon's of music. And outside the Pokemon League... The music isn't exactly that great either, in my opinion, because... I mean, it's 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 somber, but we're at the Pokemon League. I really think it should be, you know, more... Less relaxing. It should be more... It can be somber, but it can be also, like, epic, too. That's what I want. Now, the actual theme that you get when you go in through the Pokemon League halls is actually pretty uh, epic as well. So... Also, is the emulator slowing down, or is it just my imagination? Because it usually doesn't slow down for me, so... Um, okay. Uh, should be running. Yeah. Now let's go in. To this. Now let's go see Aeron. Ah, I should've used two of my floor stores! No, I forgot! <laughs> I do, I've been doing that a lot lately, it seems. Oh my god, I can't believe I forgot. Uh no, this isn't good. I should have used to my floor. Oh, did I just say the exact same thing twice? Now, this thing I know is going to use evasion buffs because it's done so in the past. I guess I'll still go with Togekiss because... 
Speed's gonna be risen, so that's not gonna bode well for me. I still use Air Slash. No, it's using another double team. Why is he using double team again? I mean, I, I know it's just using evasion buffs here. Um. Okay, he's starting to get really annoying now. Oh, it's using Air Slash on. Uh, I'm not too happy about this. Not too happy. I should have, you know, I should have gone to my low tick since I guess I have Ice Beam, and that's gonna be quad effective. So this hits it on its first try. Nope, nope. I thought it might be funny for it to hit on its first try, but no. Well, then again, I guess it really wasn't that good of an idea for him to switch out like that. I mean, like remove that edge he had. You know, like, like it remove, remove that status buff he had. Oh, now the tables are starting to turn in my favor. Now the shoes on the other glove, pan. Okay, I'm gonna keep battling. Uh, I think my ice beam will do good, and I think I will outspeed it. I think, I think therefore I am so, and I am very. Now things are getting a bit. I've always wondered why these trainers always just specialize in, like, how can they coincidentally just specialize in one type and nothing else? And I think I've got both a story explanation and a development philosophy kind of explanation for both. In that, um, what was I gonna say? Um,. The story wise, I guess they're just more in tune since these characters are, you know, like actually using these Pokemon as, like, you know, actual animals and they aren't just, you know, characters on a screen. Um, I don't know if I ever use that word, but characters on a screen, but. I meant to say I didn't know why I used But. I think it won't have its evasion buffs anymore uh, for my, on the Mega, by the way, but um, something like uh, here's the thing: the Pokemon Adventures manga. I noticed that Lorelei had like ice, who was an ice type user, had ice, ice like powers, and and I won't, I, won't, I also won't forget to use my four stores this time. I'll use three of them now, but. Like she had a, like a ice type user had ice type powers, ice powers, and Agatha, who's a ghost type user, had like mind control and whatnot. And Lance, the dragon, you know, type user, could talk to dragon like Pokemon. So I realized that they, I guess, psychologically, each of these trainers just has some bond with some specific type. So, but then again, I always thought that there, why I was wondered why the in the gyms at least they always have these. Like, these trainers always have these cultish devotions to the type, so... I didn't know. At least that's the way I've thought of it. What the... Okay, I don't know what happened there. Like, it kind of froze-ish. But... Um... In development-wise, I guess it's just easier for them to make memorable teams if they're all variations on a theme. I I'm just gonna guess that's... That's basically the reason why I think, like, develop. It's it's harder to develop teams if they each, you know. So, um, Bertha is actually going to be kind of funny. That Aaron's usually a really easy guy to fight, but he's actually kind of caused me some trouble here. Bertha is usually much easier on me whenever I do this, because she doesn't really in in the way of type advantages. She doesn't really have much to counter the types that would, you know hurt me. I, I, sorry, the types that would, that are strong against her, so I've kind of been... What was I gonna say? Oh, God. That's why she, like, she doesn't really counter the types that are strong against hers. I can't believe it took me that long to say that, but... Um... Hyperior, uh, I'm gonna keep you out, because I'm, you know, still quad effective, if that's the word I'm still... If I'm using the correct terminology there. And I think this is her... Is her Hippowdon the last one she has? Like, I, I think Hippowdon's the last one, so... But then again, she isn't coming out and doing a little speech that you usually do when she sends out her last Pokemon. Um, 
Oh, now she is. She is. She is. Full restore. No! Ah, uh, Roserade's gonna fall asleep. I can't believe I didn't see that coming. Uh, oh, it fainted. How come it fainted that time? Is there some mechanic I don't know about where sometimes a move will do slightly more damage, just for no reason? Because for some reason a move that that didn't take it out that one time took it out this time. Um, now we're going up to Flint, the fire user, and, um, Flint, I used to make this really, really, really horrible joke when I was about 10 about Flint, and it's about his resemblance to Ronald McDonald with the hair, um, basically, I just asked the question, is Flint Ronald McDonald's evil twin? Then the victim, the freaking victim of the joke would say, uh, I, 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 I'd have it for them to say yes, but then I'd say, no, Ronald McDonald is way too evil to be the good twin. Yeah, and I thought that was extremely funny when I was, like, ten. Oh, also, I need to mention I'm starting off with Spear Tomb all the time because... Wait, did I mention already that Spear Tomb is... You know, like, I'm trying to replicate pretty much what she has. Like, as well as I can, I'll replicate what she has, you know, on her team. pretty much all I have to say on that, the fact that Spear Tomb, since she uses a Spear Tomb. And boy, I'm going to lose up a lot of power points for um, Earthquake, I'm honest, because I'm basically going to be, my plan is just to spam Earthquake this whole time, it tends to work for me in the past, so. Yeah, Flint, usually these guys are pretty difficult, but Flint and, in terms of just type advantage, all I have to use is, you know, Garchomp for Flint, and then I have Roserade and Milotic for Bertha, so. That part is actually really easy. We have another Infernape here. Um, yeah, these guys are basically tombed. Uh, the only thing I worry about is Cynthia's Garchomp, because I guess you don't know, have to go against it and, like, with my own. I think that if I can outspeed it, perhaps I could, you know. And, oh, and now that I've defeated Flint, I guess kind of the funny thing about him is that, you know, with Volkner, who was his friend, Volkner started off all emo and kind of not, he was very som, I was about to say somber, um, subdued and kind of non-expressive, and then Flint is all, and then, then he, then Volkner starts to become excited as he remembers the fun of battling. Flint is kind of the opposite. He starts out excited, but then he gets tired and starts becoming really, you know, really uh, subdued as well. So, Spirit Mirror has no weaknesses, so um, I think it's actually because of the type advantage, you know, being part dark type might help me out here. Oh, Thunderbolt, will that do much? No? Okay, good. But, <laughs> okay, sorry for that. Nothing there. Lucian's actually, as a character, I'd find him to be pretty badass, actually, but, but nothing. It's actually... He's going to use a full restore. Yes, he is. All right. Can't believe I, for some reason, I've been forgetting lately, but... All right, let's hope this gets him out. Or will it donk out me? <gasps> what? Critical! Uh... I'm too happy about that. I am not too happy about that at all. Um, who am I going to risk here? Uh, someone speedy. I think Togekiss has been rather fast, so maybe I'll try Togekiss. But maybe I'm, I'm, I'm death sentencing myself here. No, he's using psychic. Oh, it got me. I mean, sorry, I got it. Okay, so like, as in, it didn't hurt me that, that much. Okay. I can't believe so many of my Pokemon are like still up and running. Oh, citrus berry, stone edge. Oh, it didn't kill me. What? Okay. It missed. Nah. Okay, never mind. Two of them are down. Who do I have Psychic on? Let me... Wait, is he res... Would he still be resistant? Uh, I think I'm gonna, you know... I'm gonna try Lucario, and I'm gonna try out an, uh, a Shadow Ball, I suppose. See if that does it. No. Drain Punch, is that gonna do much against me? Uh, did more than I thought, but... I think he will go down. Oh, he doesn't! Why doesn't he go down? Why did he not go down? He should have gone down to that. Okay, you're you got a bit more fight in you than I expected. I'm I'm kind of worried. I, I don't want to lose Garchomp for the Cynthia fight. I mean, technically, since I'm treating Lucian like the champion here, 
It'll still be technically a victory, but... Yeah, I don't... I, I guess I'm a bit paranoid about losing Garchomp that I lost three other useful Pokemon. Or however many I, I lost. Oh, full restore. That's nice. Oh, uh, and it didn't... I'm not gonna... Am I gonna kill this thing? Please, please. Combine again? What? Oh, he's gonna use another full restore. Oh, he isn't. Sorry, I guess I spoke too soon there. Um... I say he's gonna use another full restore when when I saw on the screen that he wasn't gonna. But I'm gonna try another earthquake here. Uh, cause I don't think this thing is high. Yeah, I think I, I do. It. Earthquake would. So I do have one more full restore. Um, Garchomp's at full health, and so yeah, if Garchomp is at full health, then I think I might be good here. But I'm not gonna. Uh. Hello everybody, I'm back. Sorry for that quick, you know, leaving there. I was just saving. Now let's use my last full restore on one of these guys who who to use on. Okay, I don't think either of these two need it. You know what? I'll save it for the battle, and if I need to use it, like at any point, like within the battle, I will. Maybe on Guard Chomp, who knows? So I will need that Guard Chomp. I can tell you that much. Now let's go. So Cynthia, she we we have proven that she is more than capable of taking on the entire Elite Four with just four four stores. Not that that's that big a surprise to me. Not only is she a really badass character, but we are. But gameplay wise, she is actually a big step up from the Elite Four. So we are here, and I'm using Roserade first. Yeah, that psychic. No, you know, so no, I'm spiritual anymore. Would I be allowed to not have choose which Pokemon I have to go? I think so because. Let's see, the next... Yeah, the next one on our team would be... Roserade, I do believe. If I'm not correct, I'm just going to check my moves. I'm going to see if Gar... I'm going to go with Garchomp. I'm going to see if this works. Okay. I'm, for some reason, I feel like not speeding this up. A Psychic. Will that do much? I'm kind of tank-ish, but... Okay. I, I didn't think it would do much. Earthquake! Oh, God. Does it have high defense? I don't think it does. Wait, this is a special move. No, wait. Is the Earthquake special or physical? No, wait, it's physical. It's physical. It's physical. For a second, there, I thought it might be special. Wait, it doesn't... Didn't... Didn't die? Now, I did gain a more than, like, uh... I did gain an extra level during that whole thing, so... So that does... So I guess I, I think I will outspeed her Garchomp here. But I'm just going to see if one Dragon Rush can kill this thing. And as I said, even though I'm, I'm one level ahead of it, I don't feel bad about being, like, slightly over one level, considering that three of my Pokemon are dead. Now that's my Garchomp, right? Yes. Alright, let's hope this does it. It's a very powerful move. But will it tank it? Will it tank it? Will it tank it? Ugh! Wait a minute. It has Citrus Berry and I don't. And I'm not at full health. It might take me out, people! Flinch! <laughs> yes! 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 Oh my god. Yes, yes, yes. Oh god. That feels so good! Ha! <laughs> yeah. Ugh. I am... Ugh. That felt good. For evil Garchomp. My low tick. You know what? I'm gonna go with uh, Rose Raid, even though... I don't know, I'm just gonna, I know it, it might be faster than me, it might, and if it doesn't use his Ice Beam, but I guess if he uses Ice Beam, I'm not gonna be exactly how you say alive anymore. Yes! I'm faster, but is it gonna tank this? Is it gonna tank it? I'm not quite sure if it will. Uh, please don't tank it, please don't tank it, please don't tank it. I mean, please do, yeah, please don't. Mirror Coat? Why? Oh, um. It is going to be effective, but why not Ice Beam? Well, it did take me out still, so... I will grant you that. I think I'm going to outspeed this thing, and she's not going to use a full restore, I don't imagine, so... I think I'm safe here. Yep. I'm safe. If it doesn't take it out, I'm going to... That's going to be kind of funny. After as after all that happened... After all that happened, it's going to be... Am I going to win this on my first try? Because this is... Remember, this is a remake of a video I did earlier, so... 
if I don't know, what do I have that's good against it? Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with my little It has Shockwave, I know that, so it could take me out, but it's gonna outspeed me. I'm very sure it will, but... I'm, I'm very certain it will outspeed me, but... I have a couple of Ice Beams. Yeah, it's gonna be a Shockwave. Now, will I survive this? Because I think... Come on, Milotic, will you tank this? I mean, not, not, I mean, I guess not dying isn't technically, isn't always tanking, but... Alright, now, will Ice Beam do much? Please, 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 please. Because remember, this is, anyway, this is a remake of it earlier. It didn't even do half damage. Okay, it, it might kill me here. I didn't quite see if it, if it took away, like, more than half blast. Maybe I should have used the floor store. No, no, you know what? I'm too paranoid to use my floor store, but... You know what, maybe, you know what, I don't know if there's some mechanic in this game that makes an attack do slightly more damage, but if it takes it out, then please, please do, or freeze it. No, it doesn't. And it's gonna, she's gonna use the floor store, so you know what, I'm going with another ice beam. Or I should've used the floor store myself, no, ah! Uh, you know what, I'll, I'll do it next turn, I'll do it next turn, I'll do it next turn, and if it, unless, unless it freezes, yeah. Or should I have saved my floor store for Garchomp? Decisions, decisions, decisions. I'm going. I, I'm risking it. I've worked too hard to not get this. All right. Is Shockwave going to do much against me? Let's hope not. I'm also kind of pressed for time here because something's going to happen that'll be. A bit... All right. I'm a bit. You know, I'm not sure if I made a good decision here, but. If she gets a critical hit, I'm going to be so mad, considering that epicness that of her Garchomp flinching. I have no power points for Ice Beam! Oh, I made a bad choice! I made a bad choice. I didn't realize it. I have no power points for Ice Beam, people. Oh, no. So I just made a bad decision. Ugh, I'll just see if Dragon Pulse does the job. Mirror coat. I'm going for a mirror coat, people. If it doesn't, it's, it's, I don't think it'll kill me. And if it doesn't, uh, maybe I should have done that from the beginning. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I probably should have. Oh, I hang on with 4 HP. Oh, 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 oh. That feels good. That feels so good. Thank Gorshness. Thank you. I don't know you I don't know what I'm either thinking or thinking. Roserade. Um considering that I outspe wait, it might outspeed me. Will it outspeed me? I don't have Ice Beam anymore, so maybe I'm just gonna go for Dragon Pulse. Nope, nope, nope. I was I can't believe I forgot that I it, it I outsped it last time. Oh god, I So those those two lucky moves got just got dwarfed by this stupid move. Okay. Garchomp, I'm, I'm hoping you can do this. I'm hoping you can do this. I have only three PP left on Dragon Rush. I should have used Flamethrower, because I only have three PP left on Dragon Rush. Oh, God. Uh, people. I'm hanging on the edge of my boots here. Okay, she has one last Pokemon. Fire. I hope Flamethrower kills it. I can't remember the last time I'm back in the corner like this, but I'm backed in the corner, too. Does it have? I, I think it has a high special. It, it doesn't have that high special defense, does it? Does it? Does it? It's gonna be super effective. Now let's hope it doesn't kill me. Or sphere. Will this kill me? If this kills me, uh, I'm gonna be so worried. Yes! I still have the citrus berry. <laughs> I thought I didn't. Okay. And if she doesn't use a floor store here. Okay, thank God! Oh, she should have used the floor store on her end. Well, she shouldn't have, because that would have really made me mad. But I won! On my first... Well, I guess not technically my first try, since I've done this... This is a remake. But the first try of the remake. Let me put it that way. Ah! Uh, and I didn't... Just a few minutes ago, you were the most powerful challenger. And just now you became the most powerful trainer of the trainers. You are now our newest champion. I'm more than that, Cynthia. I'm the champion of champions. I am... I am so... I am a champion that is so awesome that I beat myself after I went through the entire Elite Four. 
and without any milk. So I didn't have a fresh milk or whatever you call it to restore my HP. I only had the four floor stores. Now, I'm not going to speed up this time. I'm going to save for this. <laughs> okay, I made some stupid moves here because I'm the stupid genius 55, so. Wow, I wasn't actually intending for that to be any pun there, you know, on the stupid. Well, not a pun, but I, I didn't expect my name to have any... Sig I didn't d realize that the significance of my name there for a quick second. Uh. Now, our people are arriving at my house, because my younger sister is having a party-ish thing. Yeah, not, yeah, party-ish thing. And I don't want to be here while guests are at the house. I mean, doing... Well, yeah, I don't want to be here while guests are at the house, but I also don't want to be LPing. Well, the, this is an LP. This is a champion testing leap for a one-off thing. I can edit this while I'm there. <sighs> so it's going to have these four. I remember, people, it, I will redo this video if I'm told how to correctly simulate Cynthia's effort values, but for now, I think this is pretty good. And I guess, you know, I don't know if... I don't, I don't really think it's cheating when I... Maybe it'll be considered cheating the fact that they gained a couple levels, because I made sure each of them was at least one level... was one level below how they should have been... So that if they gained a level, it'd be... But they either would gain more than one level. But then again, since I'm going through five trainers with minimal health buffs, I think that's... I think I'm justified. And then again, even then, one of my floor stores actually didn't help me. One of the floor stores actually was a stupid move on my part. And I will be seeing you some other time. I guess can't really show the credits when just the top screen's being shown, so... And I'm too lazy to edit the bottom screen in, so... You all have a good one. I'm trying to tip my hat to you, but I don't... You can't see it, and I don't have a hat. <laughs>